Happy Tuesday, Sweatbox family. Here we are again with a wicked workout for you. Chris and Mark here. Hello. Good morning. All right, we are bringing you a pyramid workout. I was looking back over our records over this. We've done a pyramid workout in quite a long time. Today's I'm missing it. We're going to fill that hole in our hearts today. <laughs> Today's your lucky day. Today's your lucky day. <laughs> so we've got 30 second rounds for you. So round one, we're just going to do a single exercise. That exercise is going to be air squats. We're going to do air squats for 30 seconds, and then we're going to take a 30 second rest. Round two, we're going to introduce inchworm shoulder taps. So we're going to hinge at the hips. We're going to do an inchworm walkout. Nice tight core in that plank. We're going to tap our shoulders. Feet nice and wide, we're gonna walk back in. We're gonna do that for 30 seconds. We're gonna do air squats for 30 seconds, and then we're gonna take a rest. Round three, we're gonna introduce push-ups. So push-ups for 30 seconds. You know we have no preference if you're doing these push-ups on your feet or on your knees, as long as those hips are down. No tabletop position. After the push-ups, we're doing inchworms. Inchworms to air squats. Air squats to 30 second rest. You get where this is going. Round four, we're going to introduce crab toe touches. Nice and controlled the whole time. Keep that butt nice and tight. Core engaged. Round five, we are going to be bringing in reverse lunges. And as you can see, we need no equipment for today. Except for round six, you're just going to want to have a marker of sorts. So, it doesn't matter what it is, a dumbbell, a piece of clothing. Not your phone. Not your phone. Nothing breakable, nothing valuable. We are going to do a lateral hop over whatever it is, and we're going to go into a full burpee back up, lateral hop on the other side. And that's it. Those are the six rungs to our pyramid. So we're going to go up one side of that pyramid, and then we're going to come right back down the other. You <laughs> ready? You ready to lead our warm up now that I just put you through your own mini workout? <laughs> That's okay. All right, guys. We're going to go 20 seconds per movement here. Let's just start swinging those arms, walking them out, squeezing our shoulder blades back, crisscross the arms. Woo. Feels good. Get that blood flowing, pumping through your arms. Woo. All right. Roll those arms back, big arm circles. Other direction. Stay in control as you're rolling those arms forward. Whew. Okay, hands on your hips, we're going into a good morning. So push those hips back, back nice and flat. Come straight back up, squeezing your glutes. Here we go. Inhale down. Pause for a second. Exhale up, squeeze those glutes. Again. There we go. One more. Down and up. All right, finally, we're going into crisscross jacks. We're going to start in a star position, crisscrossing our arms and feet. Whoa. There we go. Tested my coordination this morning. <laughs> Making you think it's not Monday, so we graduated to Tuesday. All right, keep that core nice and tight. 10 seconds. All right, rest up, guys. Okay. All right, so we are going to start just with air squats. Set those fitness trackers. All right, here we go. All righty, 30 seconds of air squats, followed by a rest. This is the easy round. Pushing those knees and toes out as you're coming down. Again, exhaling on the way up and inhaling on the way down. Try and get your hips past neutral, so get as low as you can. Pushing those heels. We're actually pushing the floor away from you. That's it. As you're coming up. Try not to snap your knees as you're coming up. All, All right. right. 30 second rest. Then we're going to be introducing inchworms. So inchworms, then air squats. Inchworm shoulder touch. That's right. All right. 
Again, karate chopping those hips. You don't want to bend your knees to get down into that inchworm. Here we go. Enjoy this rest. This is going to be the longest rest <laughs> of the day. Okay. In four, three, two, and hinge. Walk out into that plank position. Tuck that pelvis. Touch your shoulders. Walk straight back up. Make sure that their feet are, your feet are flat on the floor before coming back up to standing. Don't shift your hips. Control that walk out. Five seconds. Woo, rest. All right, nope, oh, come on up, it's air squat. squat. It is not rest, Who not yet. Rest? Not you, not us. <laughs> Try not to bounce at the bottom of that air squat. Pause for just a tiny second and then push that floor away as you're driving up through your heels. All righty, now you can rest. That sounds better. Grab a little drink and get ready. We are bringing push-ups in next. <sighs> okay, heart's starting to go. Eating like crazy now. All right, when we do those push-ups, we're gonna keep those elbows back behind us. Keep our hands stacked underneath our shoulders. Here we go. Get into position. When that before goes, we're starting our first rep. <laughs> Let's go. Inhale down. Exhale up. Core nice and tight here. Eight seconds. All right, inchworms. That's it, walk it up. Don't rush it, stay in control. You're, you're using your abs to control walking out and especially walking back. All right, the last few seconds here, gang, then we're going right back into air squats. All right. Come on up. Right down and up. Feeling a little fire in my quads now. Halfway up that pyramid, halfway to the peak. Okay. Coming up next, we're going to be doing crab toe touches. So again, on the floor we're bridging up, keeping our abs nice and tight. Opposite hand to foot. Name of the game here, stay in control. I don't need you flailing. I don't need you going crazy with swinging arms, swinging legs and breaking your coffee table. <laughs> Exhale as you're coming up to touch that foot. If you can't touch your foot, touching your ankle's good. We're gonna do a little break dance. Flip around into push-ups from here. Four, three, two. All right. All right, push-up time. I've dropped down to my knees. So I can keep my form on point and bring my chest all the way down to the floor. Burning triceps right now. Oh yeah. Find your I'm, pace, guys. I'm feeling my triceps after <laughs> yesterday. All right. Oh, come on up, we're doing inchworms. Now is not the time to stop for a drink. Now is the time to move to the next 
Block of work. Try not to rock your hips side to side when you're doing your shoulder touch. All right, air squats it is. Here we go, come on, Chris, push through. Yeah. Remember, like Mark said last round, don't bounce down. Control. Squeeze that butt at the top. We're not so worried about number of reps. We want you to be working on quality every time. All right. All right. It is rest time. It is. Get ready. Reverse lunges are coming in next. Quick reminder, don't tight rope this. Step out to the side as you drop that rear knee straight down, keeping your chest nice and vertical. Pause for a second. Go down into that lunge again. Because Mark's bringing his back knee straight down, his front knee will not go over his toe. Okay, keep that in mind. Here we go. Alternating. All right. Get that back knee an inch off the floor. There's no need to connect to the floor. Besides, it hurts if you whack yourself. Hands up for balance if you need it. Core nice and tight. Shoulders back. We're going into crab toe touches next. Look how fast this is going, seriously. All right. Come on down. Go. Again, in control, you don't need to go fast. Keep those hips bridged nice and high. I don't need us down here. I need us up here. Your feet can be wide. That will help you. Seven seconds. Three, two, push-up time. Here we go, push-up time. Okay, keep those hands under your shoulders. Full extension at the top. Oh, I'm sweating now. Here comes the inchworms. All right. All right. Up. Karate chop those hips. Walking it out. Touch those shoulders. Walk back. Right up to standing every time. Squeeze your butt at the top. Full exhalation at the top. Three seconds till squat time. Woo! All right. Now we go. Let's do this. Nice and deep. When you go deep, that's great. Just try not to pull your pelvis under. You still want to stick that booty out as you're coming down. Three seconds till break. Woo! Wow. All right. Great job, guys. We are here. We are at the top of the pyramid. Grab your marker, your tea towel. Your skipping rope, doesn't matter what. Small dumbbell works too. Yep. So again, we're gonna do a lateral hop into a full chest to floor burpee. Back up and lateral hop to the other side. We're gonna keep doing that for the whole 30 seconds. Easy peasy. So easy peasy. Ready? Two, one. All right. All the way down, all the way up. Stay in control. Use your abs to pull your legs up. Back to standing. Or jumping, I should say. Come on, three more seconds. You got this. Alrighty. Knock that marker out of the way. We're going right into reverse lunges.
Think about how good you feel right now. I feel awesome. Heart's racing. Blood's pumping. We're all on this side of the grass. Touch your breath here. Crab toe touches is next. All right. There we go. Again, yeah. hips low. No, hips high. Yes. <laughs> Worms is coming up. Four seconds. Keep at it. All right. Uh, oh, I feel the quads. Uh -huh. All right, pause. When you're in that plank, if you're feeling your back here, it's because you're not tightening up that core. So keep those abs tight. And when you're in that plank position, Tuck that pelvis underneath. Also, check your feet. Your feet should be wider than your shoulders. Give yourself that nice, solid Squat. platform. <gasps> Squat time. Push that floor away from you. Remember, no bouncing. Control every movement. Eight seconds. Ugh. All right, rest time. All right, guys. That is it. We have just crested the peak of the pyramid. Okay. So we are going to do that final round, that previous round, one more time. And then we're going to work our way down. So enjoy it. In 12 seconds is going to be the last time we're doing burpees today. Yes, we said today. I know some of you guys caught that. That's okay. All right, everybody. Here we go. Jump. Burpee. Back up. If you need to step out for your burpee, that's fine. You just need to keep moving. Remember, today is about challenging yourself. Wide feet. 
I see a sweat trail. How about you, Mark? Oh, Maybe it's coming. Oh. Don't get lazy, guys. Laziness and bad form can lead to injury. We want to keep you guys safe. All right, let's squat it out. Only gonna get shorter from here. Final ten seconds. We earned that rest. High five, Mark. High five, Chris. Alrighty. Here's where it gets faster. We're going downhill, going down the far side of that pyramid now. No more burpees. We're going to start the next round with our reverse lunges. Okay. Oh. Yep. It's a warm one. Oh, close my exercise ring for today. <laughs> That's awesome. Okay, here we go. Barely even 10 o'clock in the morning. Woo! Two. Let's go. Remember, push up off that front heel, not the back toe. If I catch you pushing off with that back toe, I'm gonna make you do. Uh, I'm gonna make you do one-legged lunges. Gonna keep that back foot up in the air. We don't want that. So don't do that. Don't push off with that toe. Push up through that front heel. <sighs> Crab toe touches. Let's do this. Nice and control. Now turn, make sure I'm not blocking your guys' view of the timer. <laughs> Push up this next. Stay strong and focused. Okay. Oh. All right, inchworm. Start thanking your body what you can do, not what you can't do. You are strong. You got this. Lots of endurance here today. No, no, no need for a break till the end, because you got it. Woo! You ready for squats? Here we go. Let's do this. You can see we're pausing at the top to make sure those glutes, abs, and quads are nice and tight. If you're just doing this, you're not doing anything. You're moving your skeleton. We're not here for that. Break time. Break time. I've lost track. I think we're doing crab toe touches sure next. Are. That's what we're starting with. So look at that. No more burpees. No more reverse lunges. That's it. And only two more rounds of pushing. <laughs> I might go back on my toes for these guys. All right, here we go. Assume the position, guys. Get down. All right, when that beeper goes, we'll start our first rep. Let's do this. Ready? Go. Yeah. Make that connection with your foot or your ankle. Get those hips up. Final 10. Keep at it. Push-ups are coming. Right now. Here they are. Here we go.
Keep that core tight, tuck that pelvis underneath. Squeezing those shoulder blades together as you're coming down. Push it right back up, less than 10 seconds, guys. Inchworms is next. Three, two, one. All right, here we go. Inchworm. Don't get lazy. Do not sag your back here. Core stays tight. Final eight seconds, everybody. We are earning this next break. Right to the end. Awesome work, guys. We've gone up the pyramid, and we've come halfway down the far side. We only have three tiers left. We're gonna do push-ups, we're gonna do inchworms, and air squats. Those are our three starters. So that means right now you are about to do your final set of push-ups for the day. Okay. Hopefully that motivates you to get through them. Let's do this. Let's get serious, do them right every time. just to make sure that form is on point. Oh. All right, watch this fancy transition. Push up, and I'm walking right into that inchworm. Right back up to standing, squeeze those glutes. Squat time. Enjoy that burn, guys. Your body is working so hard right now. Final five seconds. Some work, guys. Two runs left. We're gonna start the next round with our inch worms. Right. <sighs> uh huh. Feels good. Sure does. I'm so sweaty. I don't have to keep hiking my pants up now. They're not falling down at all. <laughs> all right, ladies and gentlemen, tighten those ponytails. Here we go. In three, two, one. Hinge. Yes, you will feel your hamstrings as you're coming down into that inchworm. That hinge really turns those hammies on. Woo. Control the walkout. How are your arms doing, Mark? They're doing better than expected. All right. All right, into those air squats. Enjoy that rest, gang. We are here. Final 30 second set. All we gotta do is air squats. We've gone up. We've come all the way down. We are here. 
Telling your friends. That's right. Spread the word. Hit the thumbs up on the video if you like this workout. Please subscribe if you have not already. Both of those actions cost you nothing and help us immensely. Absolutely. You can grab the link, share it on social media if you like as well. If you have our permission, you are more than welcome to do that. Oh. <sighs> All right. Shall Warrior. we pull an arm across? Yes, we will. <laughs> that shoulder out of your ear. We talked about all the things that sometimes we have a habit of doing ourselves. Bring that shoulder down, relax it, pull across. All right, let's switch sides. Now we did a good chunk of push-ups today, which means after we finish this upper back stretch, we are gonna go in and do a nice chest stretch. Thank you. Alrighty, shake those out. Alrighty, I want palms up, thumbs out in front of you. Open up as wide back as you can. A couple of nice big breaths. Alrighty, take those hands, flip them all the way over. Palms down, palms back, thumbs down. Finish that stretch out towards the back. That's it, gang. Shake it out. That is today's workout for you for Tuesday, Sunday in June. <laughs> and we will be back tomorrow on Wednesday with another amazing workout. Another high five to Chris, another high five to you guys. Have an amazing day. Get out there, enjoy the beautiful weather. <clears throat> and we'll see you tomorrow. You bet. Have a great day, everybody.